Highway 516 between Dryden and Savant Lake. On my way to Pickle Lake, I may make it. Oh my goodness, I'm getting closer. I'm getting closer. I am like, this is just gorgeous out here. And I'm looking for caribou because caribou forest. So you would think that that would mean that there were caribou in this forest. Not necessarily though. I've been down lots of cemetery roads that don't have any cemeteries on them. I don't understand the naming convention of that, but there are just some things that you have to go, hmm, that's kind of weird. I just want to show you a little bit of this drive. It's just gorgeous up here. Like I said, I've got no internet or phone at the moment. I'm not even sure if I'll have internet or phone when I get to Pickle Lake. Uh, I sent them an email and asked them, but I didn't get a response back yet. So, but they have a little campground up there and uh, with RV hookups and everything. So it's like $15 a night. I mean, it's rustic. There's no showers, but then there's no showers anywhere. So it makes no difference. I did my laundry when I was at the hotel, so I don't have to worry about that. All I have to do is uh, worry about milk for coffee. And I've got enough to last me a little bit. <laughs> Depends on how many coffees I have, I suppose. No caribou yet. There's some, like, awesome little roads, though, by... Um, it's been raining for like days and as you can see by the clouds and the little raindrops on the windshield coming it doesn't look like it's going to stop anytime soon so I think maybe I got another day of rain and then hopefully we'll get a break in it and we'll get some clear sunny days and when I got to Thunder Bay it was like 80 degrees it was like a clear sunny day and then the storm clouds were been a great trip so far. Um, this will be actually uh, the first night that I paid for accommodations and it's only 15 bucks a night. So I'm okay with that. I'm trying to boondock it as much as I can everywhere just because you know I just want the experience of it. I'm in my home province so I feel a little bit better about it. don't know you know in other places how people are going to be but it's a gorgeous drive even on a dull day you can see the sun trying to peek through every now and then but I don't think we're going to get that maybe tomorrow so I should arrive at Pickle Lake hopefully by sunset anyway because I don't like to drive on the back roads especially um, due to moose and bears and deer and caribou. They can do a lot of damage and no damage please. So I hope you're having a great day. On with my travels in search of caribou. I'll let you know if I see any. Have a great day. Don't forget to check out my blog chipmunksrvlife.com I will put the link in the description. Uh, click